Hello Plankton, I'm Colonel Failure and you're looking at Mega Aquarium, the upcoming aquarium based tycoon game type deal. Uh, in, the, uh, in the previous episode uh, we, uh, we, we killed a lot of, we, we killed a lot of coral. Um, yeah, that, that didn't go great, uh, but it's okay, we turned it around uh, and we also populated this, uh, this feature tank here with, uh, with quite a lot of stripy fish, I think it's, it's fair to say. They just kind of hang around the place being fish. Uh, people pay me money to come and look at the fish being done. Um, anyway, today uh, we've just unlocked, uh, or I'm currently working on the research to unlock the deep wall tank. Oh, um, and then we've got to build one. So if you stick around, pretty certain that, that's probably what you're going to get. Uh, right then, okay, so we've got the, uh, we've got a tank researched and now it's uh, simply a case of figuring out where we're going to stick it. Uh, I've got eight and a bit grand uh, in the bank and that should be enough to get me rolling. Um, I've slowed things down a smidge from the breakneck speed we had previously because uh, obviously I want to uh, I want to get this under control. Uh, right, let's pause this up and then uh, we'll expand out. I don't know, what do we like the looks of here? So if I put it in here, we've got a potential extra area in there. What I'm hoping to unlock soonish is a, is a large pump uh, that can handle many, many tanks. Um, so that I can build kind of a machine room idea to uh, to look after that. Uh, right, let's uh, let's go out this way. That's 560. In fact, you know what we're going to do here? Yeah, we're going to we'll take out the entire length uh, for our for our future expansion. There you go. That's a, so that's a goodly amount of expansion right there. Now we either leave it paused, which is the wise thing to do. Um, yeah, we go. We'll leave it paused. I want to redevelop this uh, this internal tank storage fixture kind of deal that we've got going on here anyway, because it's a little bit of a it's a bit of a faff to be honest. It's it's not well it's not well positioned because you've got this shed attached to the tank so that we can uh, we can maintain the thing. Um, no matter. We'll we'll worry about that in a minute. Uh, right, a deep deep observer tanks. That's the stuff. Right, okay, let's, uh, uh, right, let's rotate you round. So, observer tanks allow people to, uh, to get, get their fix of the tank from, uh, uh, from several different angles. However, I need to buy a bit more, uh, a bit more land. Otherwise, you know, those of you who are, who, who have a certain taste for the, the purer size of, of rooms are going to get a bit upset. Um, let's get, let's think this through here. Oh, you know what we could do? Well, this is ambitious. You've not built one of these before, and all of a sudden you're going, Oh, yeah, let's build something flipping gargantuan. All right, well, you only want to leave two bits of space in between each set of tanks. So let's uh, let's rock that one there. And, yes, I know, I am aware that it needs a platform in order to be serviced. Can I stick that next to it and everything's dandy? No, I can't. Okay, kill that. Do I need to uh, deep wall tank? Swing that around there. Will that connect up if I do a bit of that action? No? No, it won't. Treats them as two separate tanks. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. Right, okay. Well, I mean, it was a, it was a great plan. It was a beautiful dream while it lasted, but it didn't last. So we'll just, uh, well, we'll go with a bit of this instead then. Uh, now then, I need for this uh, some space so that we can uh, we can maintain the thing. And you know what's better than doing one is uh, is doing two. That's uh, that's what I've always said. There you go. Let's do another one, just like it. We'll stick a pair in. Um, and the reason that I've gone for that is because uh, typically the uh, the last objective you'll have to complete. Uh, before uh, before moving into the next uh, the next ad objective, yeah, I'm, I'm going tropical themed on those. Um, is to uh, is to get your star rating up to some ridiculous level. Uh, so uh, so I'm kind of prepping for that in advance. Now I need to stick stick a platform behind it so people can actually feed the things. Let's uh, oh, let's 
Let's make these somewhat symmetrical. And, uh, and set them up accordingly. Hold on, what have you done there? Well, you've done it wrong. That's what you've done there. No, no, that way. That's it. Good. Uh, can, we, uh, can we move it or do I need to rebuy it? No, it's good. And down. Are you interested in... Uh, interested in coming down? You're not. Okay, well, I, I, here's, here's what's in the future for you then. Right, let's uh, let's try that again with uh, with more feeling and, and better colours. Right, good. So we've got our two tanks here. That's nice. Uh, they've got all this rear space available for for sticking equipment in. Uh, let's stick some wall in there. We'll expand out further from here in the future. But for now, let's uh, actually. I'm going to leave a leave room for another door there. Uh, right, let's seal it off from the general public. Otherwise, they'll come in and they'll, you know, throw the children in and, and empty flipping bottles and, and who knows what. Uh, right, let's move this. Stick that over there. Yeah, it, it, grab yourself a, a can of Seven Up while you're uh, while you're watching the fish do the thing. Um, it's uh, both both activities are incredibly natural. Uh, Right, and we'll also we'll stick a uh, another one down here. Never knowingly undersold. All right, that looks good. Yeah, good. Right. Uh, how do you feel about that? Type deep wall tank. Done. Oh no, that's a deep observer tank. That's different. That's not a deep wall tank. You've built the wrong thing, you buffoon. Okay, well, that's, that's no problem. We'll, we'll just hack out a bit more wall here. Yeah, I know. If, you, if your original plan goes to pot because you're an idiot, uh, revise the plan. What do you think? Three? Four. Four. There you go. Right. Get rid of this. We just, uh, you know, everything's fluid. Hey, hey. Uh, it's a fish tank joke. See? Fluid. Fish tanks. Yeah? You with me? Got it? Thought you might. Right, now then. Um, in which case, flipping deep wall tank. I'm, I'm building three tanks instead of two. Oh, uh, well. I'm sure we'll make it work. I'm sure we will. Where's the edge of that? That's the, that's where you want that. So we stick that in here. And then we do a spot of... I mean, let's keep it a, let's keep it a feasible size. Do a spot of that. Bang the wall in there. No. There. Yes. Give it a door. Yeah. Some of that. Beautiful work. Alright, smashing. Alright, this this has actually turned this corner into quite the feature. Uh, although, admittedly, this drinks machine is a, is a ruddy great eyesore that we've got in there, so I'm going to move it. Uh, let's, let's bang it next to the shed. And while we're at it, let's stick the bin next to the shed as well. Then we have this... this Premier concourse uh, through which people can perambulate uh, towards the uh, the Premier League of, uh, of fish-based action. Uh, right, okay. Adjacent platform at correct height. I haven't built one yet, um, so let's uh, let's sling that in now. Yeah, you got that, and a bit of staircase like that. No, you you've got that wrong, haven't you? For some reason, it always wants to uh, go up the. Uh, it wants to go the extra level. But you know what? That's good because that means that we can have some proper enormous tanks later on. Uh, right, sufficient water quality, sufficient quality of everything. Well, that's easy enough. Uh, we'll go large filter on here. In fact, we'll rotate them. Right, you get one. You get one. You get one. Right, filtration quality for everybody. Uh, large heaters. Get some. And you. And you. 90 of 72, 90 of 60, 90 of 60. Good times. Uh, right, and then we'll, uh, we'll staff these with some fish. Hold on. Will we? Yeah, well, we will. But, uh, but I think also we'll, uh, we'll arrange uh, a selection of, of feeding items. Uh, behind the scenes. We don't want anyone to have to go too far to get the, the necessary foodstuffs. So I'll uh, I'll build a couple of them. There you go. Whether whether we need it or not, frankly. There you are. Have some mussels. 
I don't think we're going to be putting coral in here, but you you never know for sure. All right, and uh, we'll have a pair of tool stations and uh, and a broom stand for uh, for the sweeping up of dead fish that have accidentally jumped out of the tank. Uh, right, okay, so I I got some new fish recently. Oh yeah, oh, no, I'm I'm very excited by this. Um, and we're going to go... Oh, look at this, look at this dude. Right. Volatans, a lionfish. You grow up to size 11. Okay. Um, what do you eat? You eat more food than you should. Scruffy demon. Uh, it eats mussels. Fine, I'm providing that. It's armoured, so it's good against predators. Uh, it will eat crustaceans. Uh, it will eat anything, more or less. Anything below size 2. Fine. I'm I'm good with this. And it needs a, it needs a bit of hot cave action in which to dwell. All right, where well, you can live in. Uh, well, well, we'll put you in the objective case. How about that? Why are you beeping at me? Why are you saying I can't have another one? I want I want another one in there. In fact, where's the? Uh, I just built two. Interesting. Right, let's give it a rocky overhang since it does dig those the most uh, we'll stick uh, we'll stick some eel grass in it right let's try sticking another one in I didn't I didn't think it was a solo job I didn't think it didn't like anybody else being around size 6 to 11 what have we got in there remote 6 of 72 there you are look we'll make uh, we'll make quite the uh, quite the uh, the colony of, of these spiky numbers in there. Uh, I might stick some more in later on to give them some uh, some competition. Uh, but we'll see. Um, and then, what should we put in tank 2? I don't know. Let's go, let's go to the fish selection. Uh, how do we feel about fox face rabbit fish? They dislike food competitors, so they can't have anything in, else in there. Won't be housed with other species that eat green. Alright get in. We'll have three of you and then we'll have something that doesn't eat green. Uh, I don't want to go with the common stuff. I'm worried, you know, we've got something a little bit more... Uh, uh, what about this cowfish? What are you? You're a wimp so you can't hang in with bullies. That should be okay. Uh, I don't think that you are in fact a bully, are you? You're not. Um, yeah, because some, some fish just get terrified by others and then they die. Uh, the thing is, though, all these fish are pretty cheap. Uh, this is the yellow-themed tank. And one more. And another one. Beautiful. Um, let's give you some greenery. Have some kelp. Get kelped. Uh, and I'll, I'll, I'll even I'll sling, a, sling some rocks in for you as well. We'll, we'll dump some... Uh, Dump some aggregate uh, in the tank, because apparently that's a good thing. There you go. Right. Quality of water is not quite high enough. Fine, I'll uh, I'll give you another filter. Flipping heck, these little filters are rubbish these days. Get out of it. It's because I've got too many fish in there. Uh, double up on the large filtration unit. Booyah. Right. And for my last trick, what should we what should we sling in this one? Uh, some fish. Yes, very good. Uh, right, we've done the cowfish, we've done crabs. I've got more eels on the go. I just did the lionfish, the flame anglefish, angel. It's not an angle. It's an angelfish. Well done. Um, got groupers. Let's just go for a big tank full of squirrels. Okay. Obviously, these are aquatic squirrels. What do you like? You're a shoulder, so you like a you like a bunch of them. Keep coming. There you go, max tank, right there. I didn't check to see whether they get any bigger. They don't. They like to stay the size that they're at, uh, and then we'll decorate the area with something that they can uh, they can have a bit of a swim through. I am a compassionate fish keeper, as you know. Uh, right, give me this. Sling a bit of driftwood cave action in there as well. Oh, they're going to be pleased as punch. 
All right, that looks that looks promising. Now then, I'm going to need some more stuff in order to make this happen. Um, how many do I need? Uh, a couple, I reckon. I'll tell you what. All of them. We'll hire all four that are available and then unleash the hounds. Yes, we ready? We look ready. Make it happen. There we go. So, uh, so we're going to start getting points galore in here. Um, sadly, I've got nothing else to research at the moment, and we're now in the uh, in the pipeline uh, for the uh, end of mission objective. Um, 350 stars, and I'll finish this off. Uh, and that's where we'll pick things up for the next episode. Thank you very much for tuning in today. I've been Colonel Failure. I shall catch up with you very soon. Subscribe if you feel like it. Uh, like if you're feeling a bit damp. And uh, I'll see you next time. Cheerio! Cheerio!